Ariel Hawani post fight at UFC on Fox 4 alongside Joe Lozon, who beat Jamie Varner tonight. And Joe, congratulations on the win. What a performance. Best in your UFC career. I mean, I know you've had some big wins, but considering the stage, that was pretty huge. I've had some big wins, but fighting on Fox like this, this is definitely the career high. Now, in the first round, what was going wrong that you were able to sort of turn around in the later portion of the fight? Uh, we, the main thing was don't hit that overhand right. And, uh, you know, he was landing a little bit, but I was a little bit overcautious. I wasn't pushing as much as I should. And then uh, just I got more comfortable. I wasn't so worried about it. So then we pushed more and we had a lot more success. He told us that he, he thinks he broke his hand. It's obviously very injured. At what point did you realize, or did you even realize, that his hand was badly injured? I knew in the second he started throwing more elbows, but in the third round he landed overhand right, and he started shaking out the hand. I could tell by his face. So uh, th then I knew I didn't have to worry about it, and I, I just pushed a little harder. So what do you do in a situation like that when you realize he's now working at a disadvantage? Uh, well, the overhand right was the only thing we were worried about whatsoever. So once I knew his, his right hand was jacked up, you know, I just pushed and I, I wasn't worried about anything. As far as defending submissions and things like that, is that to your advantage in your opinion? Oh, definitely. You know, um, I, I definitely feel like I had the submission advantage. Um, and a couple times I had his back and I, I thought I was going to finish, but he did a good job. You know, he tripoded up and dumped me and, you know, he, he's good. You know, he, he deserves to be, you know, fighting in big fights. A nice moment where you hugged prior to the third round. Why'd you do that? Um, you know, during the, you know, before Wayne's, you know, we were in line beside each other, we were joking, we were talking, and, uh, you know, and, you know, we uh, touched gloves, you know, we were talking but during the fight, you know, like, he kicked my leg out, and I'm like, oh, I like that, you know, it was just, we were having a good time, it was a fun fight. Was there any point where he seriously hurt you? No, you know, I, I felt good the entire time, there were a couple times where he threw elbows and things, and, you know, hit me a couple times, and mi just barely missed me a few times, and got me a little concerned, but, you know, I was never, I was never in danger, I was never worried, I was never hurt. We, you know, we've talked about this. You sort of take one step forward, one step back. Do you think this could be the moment that allows you to go on a big streak here in the UFC? I hope so. You know, I, I think I've gotten better with every fight camp. Uh, you know, I like to think that we've gotten smarter about training and, and things like that. Uh, I just got to stay healthy in camp and, you know, just keep, you know, keep putting on good performances. Congrats, Joe. Thank you.